is fun, boy. <laughs> I like this game. Goose walking. Goose walking, don't mind me. Are you enjoying this? No. Screen says, Untitled Goose Game by House House. As elders, we, we're not good with games. I'm good at chess and golf. Well, today you're going to be playing this video game that just came out recently called Untitled Goose Game. The Untitled Goose Game. Wow, they're very, very creative. All right, so first we're going to have you run through this little tutorial of the game that explains how it works so you can learn how to play. Press this. to honk. <laughs> it says press Y to honk. <laughs> Oh, oh, little goose. Uh, honk. Oh, I won't have to honk too, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Actually, it's funny because I was walking around the nature preserve yesterday and the goose were honking just like that. Hold B to run. This is an elder game. They move, the goose moves real slow. I like that. Now I can run him. I had the runs last week. Whoops, got off the path. Turn around. <laughs> Turn around again. <laughs> Oops, that's not right. Go right up to that tree trunk there. That's what I'm trying to do. <laughs> Push that down and then keep going. <sighs> Keep running into the tree here. Okay. There you go. Mm hmm. Perfect. Just go to the right and you've got it. Yeah! Oh, okay. Press A to use your beak. So that just means those lines show up if you can interact with it. This is a, a drunk goose. <laughs> it's a drunk goose. And then to get the bottom lock, remember that trigger with your left hand? Yeah. Hold that down and then hit A. There you go. This is cool. What is the purpose of this? I don't know. I'll have to think about this one. So now you've entered actual gameplay. So go ahead and click the little minus button on the top left hand corner of your controller. So these are your objectives. So we're gonna give you about 10 minutes to play and we'll see what happens. Get into the garden, get the groundskeeper wet, steal the groundskeeper's keys. Oh man, make the groundskeeper. So here we go, ready? So I'm looking for some damn thing. Oh, there's some stuff to bring here and I bring over there, that, take a sandwich. Why would this be fun? Okay, let's drop it. <laughs> No clue what I'm supposed to be doing here. What am I supposed to do? Get into the garden. Where is the garden? <laughs> There's a bell. Church. Oh, mercy. Is this the garden? Oh, here we go. I gotta figure out how to get in the garden. No, it's not gonna. Can I jump? Or no, go, go, no geese don't jump. No, geese mm -hmm. don't jump. Man, I suck at this. Where's the egg? Hold on a minute. Now, where's he going with the shovel? Oh, oh dear. Okay. Oh, oh, there comes the, the gardener. Okay, get into the garden. I like the game. I'm actually having fun. I don't know, maybe there's a little goose in me. I don't know. He knows the goose has got his radio. Well, maybe he's take a walk in the garden. Get in the garden. Oh, okay, yay, I did that. Okay, carry on, Elizabeth. Okay, now I gotta get him wet, as I recall. Okay, sort of sneaking around behind him. Sneak up on the ground keeper, let's sneak up on the ground keeper. Come on, come on, come on. There is a guy, sneak up. <laughs> oh! Affleck, no, just kidding, sorry, I had to do that once. Where's his keys? Now, can I chase this guy around? Ooh. 
Ah, sh yeah, he knows I'm trying, huh? <laughs> this is fun, boy. <laughs> I like this game. It's my favorite part. What's that? Try push your name. I am. Oh. It turned out the water poured in the ground. Keeper doesn't want me to do this to that again. <laughs> Don't mind me. Goose walking. Goose walking. Don't mind me. Are you enjoying this? No. Oh, there you are. I got him. You gotta run. You gotta run away. Oh. You did it. Yeah. All right. That's right as time expired. Oh, drat. But I'm having so much fun, and I'm causing such drama and, and, and chaos. So your 10 minutes are up. So we're gonna go ahead and stop you here. Just as I'm getting the hang of it. Oh darn, that was really fun. What a bunch of, what a silly way to spend your time. This is the kind of game I want my grandkids playing. <laughs> instead of people with guns and shooting. So once again, that game is called Untitled Goose Game. It should be titled The Goose and the Gardener. I don't know the purpose of it. I didn't have fun. It was fun at first, first few minutes. I love the goose and I love being able to honk, but it got boring pretty fast. So many violin games are out there. This one would be nice for kids to play. This game was only released very recently, but it's gone pretty viral, despite the $14.99 price tag to download the game. Stop it. Is that expensive? I don't even know what it costs to download games. Well, it shows there are a lot of people really bored. So many YouTubers are posting videos playing this game, celebrities are tweeting about it, and more. <laughs> you know, it's weird. This is a weird world. <laughs> Why would you tweet about this stupid little game? Some people do say it's a pretty stupid game, but others enjoy it even though it is very simple. No, because they're stupid. It's not a stupid game, it's a fun game. I can't wait to download it. What do you think it is about this game that has caused it to become such a phenomenon with so many people talking about it? It it, it just seemed nice. Maybe, you know what I'm thinking now? Maybe it's the fact it didn't have any explosions or killing. Um, maybe right now we're kind of tired. You know, a goose, you know, it's like non-threatening. Right now things are so strange and hard and people don't agree with each other and there's so much anger that this is a wonderful way to just escape. It's a break from the real world because it is simplistic. You play, you play a, a video game that's got violence in it, we're gonna play a video game, I turn on the news. It's refreshing to see a game where nobody died. I think the goose, cause the goose is adorable. And then when you see it get mischievous and try and steal the keys and do all that stuff, it's not intense. It's just pleasurable and fun. Maybe appealing to morons, uh, people with lower IQs or people who have no confidence. It's a total waste of time unless you're in the goose business. In your lifetime, you've seen the advent of kind of video games and all of its crazy evolutions. When video games first came out, did you ever think that decades later, despite all this crazy technology we have, that there would be a game that's just <laughs> you as a goose messing with people? No, 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 no. Uh, never thought about it. I'd rather read a book than play a silly game. No, I, I had no, no clue to that. Some creative people quite creating this game with, with the goose. That's how we got here, creative minds. No, no, I didn't think that the goose never entered my mind. But I did think at one time when the first video games came out and there was like Pong and Donkey Kong and things like that, you remember those? I thought this would be progress into something sophisticated and meaningful, not some goose. That surprises me, it really does. Games have gotten so complicated and so mainly violent and mean. And this is just playful. I wouldn't think there would be one that would be popular because of everybody so into the graphics and special effects. When you look back, one of the early most popular ones was um, Pac-Man. What was Pac-Man? A little thing going around eating dots and trying not to get eaten by something. Once the dots are gone, you get a new life or whatever it was. I remember, it's just fun to play a game. It's not life and death, it's just a game. Thanks for watching this untitled episode of Elders React. Shout out to Delaney. Be sure to own and subscribe for more videos every day. Thanks for watching, honk honk. Hey, it's Sierra, producer here at FBE. Do you want to support the channel and look good doing it? Well, you should check out shopfbe.com. Every t-shirt or hoodie you buy helps us bring you more videos just like this one. Bye, guys.